Hi and welcome to time zones across Australia. By the end of this video you should be able to realise that there are different time zones in Australia and how to calculate what different times there are in all the states in Australia. So let's take a look. Here is a map of our country and we have on the left hand side Western Australia and down the bottom the legend says that Western Australia is UTC plus 8. In the central of Australia we have Northern Territory and South Australia that is UTC plus 9.5 and on the eastern side of Australia, Queensland, New South Wales, ACT, Victoria and Tasmania, we have UTC plus 10. Now, we're going to take a look at what UTC stands for, but first we need to look at a world map. In this world map, we have some numbers at the top and we have all, and then some numbers in the bottom, we have the map of the world in front of us in the middle here. On the right hand side, we have Australia and above Australia, we have three numbers, plus 8, plus 9 and plus 10. Now that plus 8, plus 9, plus 10 starts at zero in the middle here of the map. Now we call this middle line, it's a longitudinal line, you'll learn more about that in geography, but it's a longitudinal line, we call this Universal Time Coordinated or UTC. You might know it as GMT, Greenwich Meridian Time, because Greenwich is a place that is in this longitudinal line where time basically gets counted from. And using this method we're able to find out what the different times are across the world. What I want to look at is what Western Australia is looking at. Now Western Australia is plus 8. Now this means that we are plus 8 hours from whatever it is on this longitudinal line in Greenwich. Now the plus 9 means that we're plus 9 hours, although when we look at the map we'll see that it's plus 9.5. And for the eastern side it's plus 10, which means plus 10 hours from whatever it is in UTC. So let's go back to that map of Australia and realise how we're going to tell the times across Australia. Now. The plus 8, the plus 9.5 and the plus 10 actually tell us how far, how far apart the times are in Australia. If I wanted to work out how much further ahead Northern Territory and South Australia are from Western Australia, I would have to add on 1.5 hours or 1.5 hours from whatever it is in Western Australia. Equally, I could subtract whatever the time is from Northern Territory and South Australia to work out what time it is in Western Australia. Similarly, we have the eastern side the eastern states and if I wanted to work out what time it was in Queensland or New South Wales or Victoria I would have to add half an hour onto the central time or two hours on from the Western Australia side. So let's take a look at an example of this. When it is 8.30 a.m. in New South Wales what time is it in Queensland, South Australia and Western Australia? Well we're going to start with Queensland here and what we have to realize is that when it's 8.30 a.m. in the eastern side of New South Wales Queensland and New South Wales are in the same time zone as each other. This means that Queensland and New South Wales will both be 8.30 a.m. When we look at South Australia, comparing it to New South Wales, South Australia is half an hour behind New South Wales. So all we need to do is subtract half an hour to get 8 a.m. In Western Australia, Western Australia is actually two hours behind New South Wales. So we're going to subtract two hours and get 6.30 a.m. And that's how you work out times in Australia using the time zones. What should we do now? Well, you should write down the heading Australian time zones and leave a space because I'm going to give you in class this picture. Then you should write down what the questions are that we went through as well as the times that we got as our answer. And that's it. Hopefully now you can work out the different times across Australia and if you have any questions you can always ask them in class. Good luck.